Cookie Jar Studios, deep in the heart of the 909, it's Ashley TV. Here's the host of Ashley TV, Ashley Garrett. Hey, what's up, peoples? I'm Ashley Garrett, and welcome to Ashley TV, your source on all the things leading up to CGX Next Play Concert Imaginarium. Saturday, May 18th at the Lewis Family Playhouse. We got a great show for you today, so let's get started. Ashley TV is brought to you in part by our proud sponsors. Iron Mike's Toilet Paper, Go Green, Go Metal, Brute 34, Men's Cologne, When 33 is Just Not Enough Brute, and Rock Band Air Freshener, the only air freshener that smells like pizza, beer, and feet. Rock Band Air Freshener. Now, back to Ashley TV. We have a fantastic show for you today, but first, we have the question of the day. Question of the day! Question of the day! Today's question of the day is, why does C.G. Rack use Imaginarium as the title for his big concert? We'll reveal the answer later in the show. Well, as you know, the Imaginarium concert is right around the corner. I thought it would only be appropriate to talk about the drumming. So, here to talk about the drumming, is my brother, one of the drum techs for the Imaginarium concert, Christopher Chainsaw Garrett. Everybody, how's it going? Thank you, Ashley, for having me here. Chainsaw Garrett, when did this happen? Well, being part of any stage crew, you gotta have a stage crew name that best fits you. Mine just so happens to be Chainsaw. Dare I ask why the nickname Chainsaw? Because I'm the lumberjack of all. That seriously just happened? Oh, it happened. Now you see what I have to go through. So, Christopher, thanks for being here. Yeah, no problem. It's great to be on set with you. I prefer you call me Chainsaw. Seriously? Seriously. So, Chainsaw. Tell us about the different drumming of the Imaginarium concert. Honestly, there's no other show out there like it. We've got a whole place backstage just for all the Brazilian drumming, just for the Japanese. We got Cuban, we got all kinds of different drums. We got, even got prop drums, which are classified information at this time. Cool. So how many drums are there in the CGX show? Well, with all the drums from the drum circle and on stage, I would say over 500 drums. 500 drums? Over 500 drums. It's got to be huge. So, Christopher, will you be playing in the jump circle? Yeah, you can find me there with all the audience. Sounds like I better get ready to get my groove on, Chainsaw. It's Chainsaw. I'd like to thank my special guest, Chainsaw, for his time. Brothers, what are you going to do? My next guest is a VIP representative for the VIP experience and the stage production manager for Disney, Kevin Valentine. Hi, hi, thank you. Hi. How are you doing? So how are you, Kevin? Uh, I'm wonderful, Ashley. Thank you so much for having me here. So, Kevin, so people can get to know you, what are you doing for what companies? All right, well, Ashley, I'm a, uh, for the last 16 years or so, I've been working at, in entertainment for the Walt Disney Company. Very cool. So how did you meet my dad? Well, I met CG way back in 2001, a long time ago. Uh, and when I was at Disney, he was a performer in a parade we had called Eureka. And my favorite role that CG did was in the Fiesta unit, which was like a celebration of the uh, California Latin culture. And uh, he was on the timbales and congas, and I used to love watching him throw up the sticks and catch it, which is not an easy thing to do on a moving float. People sometimes think that the concert is the same as CG's solo performance. Can you explain the differences? Yeah, you know, you might be walking around a, a mall, you're shopping or you're eating, and you hear some beats off in the distance, uh, where it's a, like a feast for the ears. But the one thing I don't like about those solo performances is that you're only getting, well, not even half the experience, actually. You, you step inside that theater, everything that you're seeing and experiencing is created for that purpose. So we've got world-class musicians, artists, and a whole media package that's just second to none. So you're the personal guide for the VIP experience. What's that going to be like? All right. Now, CG's always had a VIP ticket package, which is an upgraded ticket, and it has some really cool perks to it. But the VIP experience is an experience, it's just that. It's much more. Very limited number of tickets. Uh, I imagine that it's 
already sold out now, considering the seven second delay of this live broadcast here. That's an amazing experience. If I stuck to you at 20, you think you can hook me up? Yeah, I know people. What are the ages of people that can come to a CG Wright concert? The ages of people, I've seen uh, seven year olds pounding the drums at a drum circle, and uh, people in their 90s in the audience yelling, turn it up! Wow. Okay, well, before you go, we have the quick 10. 10 questions, just say the first thing that comes to mind. Go ahead. You ready? Sure, ready as I'll ever be. Coke or Pepsi? Coke. Paris, France or Paris, Hilton? Uh, Paris, France. Team Jacob or Team Edward? I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> Van Halen with Sammy or Dave? David Lee Roth. And what's your favorite movie? Probably say Raiders of the Lost Ark. Are you a dog or a cat person? I'm just a human person. Are you more of a Superman or Batman fan? Hmm, Batman. Nice choice. Yeah? Gary Busey or Charlie Sheen? Gary Busey's very entertaining. <laughs> his and what's your favorite CG Rex? There's, there's a lot on the albums, but the uh, rumba that's done during the live concert, the taxi cab rumba, as you call it, phenomenal. And one more question. If you could have dinner with anyone in the world, who would it be? Well, it would be Ashley, of course. Thanks. The amazing host is Ashley TV. Kevin, you're the best. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, Kevin Valentine. Thank you, thank you. This is the part of the show, as you know, where we do fan mail. Fan mail! Today's question comes from Cindy Clay of Northern California. Cindy asks, have you ever had a desire to drum with a real and raw, authentic tribal ceremony in the deep back part of another country? Here to answer that is my dad, C.G. Reich. Hey, Cindy. Uh, thanks for your question. Have I ever desired to drum with <laughs> back in the backwoods of uh, God knows where? Um, no. <laughs> I'm sorry to disappoint. I, I never have. Uh, jamming with the Samba Pimps is about as backwoods as I get. I really like jamming with friends, so like my buddy Chalo. Uh, back in the day, I used to go jam with Ron Powell a lot. Um, uh, my buddy Carlos, we used to jam a lot. There's a lot of different people that you know I used to jam with. There's people today I love to jam with. You know, my bro Chris Coleman, Walter Reyes Jr. Man, good personal friend. Love to play with them. So uh, not really backwoods. I, I don't know if I'd survive much out there, and uh, but I do love to play and uh, especially on stage and, and create these big things. And those are people that I look forward to playing with and, and uh, love to jam with, and, but not so much. <laughs> I hope that don't backfire on me, but I do appreciate your question. And Ashley, back to you. Earlier we had the question of the day, which was, why does C.G. Reich use Imaginarium as the title for his big concert? The answer to the question is, according to C.G., it's the best title for my philosophy as an artist to put someone's imagination on a stage and inspire them to dream. Very nicely said. Well, that's all the time we have. If you haven't got your Imaginarium tickets yet, here's how to get them. CG Rike's next big concert will be at the Lewis Family Playhouse in Rancho Cucamonga, Saturday, May 18th, with the drum circle starting at 6.15. Call the number on your screen and people are waiting to assist you. You can also order your tickets by visiting www.cgrec.com. Click on the concert icon and view the seating chart and purchase tickets via PayPal or credit card. You can also purchase tickets from all CG Rec performances. And we'll see you at the concert. From all of us here at the studio, I'm Ashley Garrett, and we'll see you on the next episode of Ashley TV. Garrett out. Ashley TV would like to thank Remo Inc., the exclusive drums and drumheads of CG Reich and the Imaginarium Concert. Strictly drive through For all your professional audio needs, give them a call at 951-271-2476. This is RJ Russ speaking from rjrust.com. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time for another episode of Ashley TV.